Okay, I'm going to shoot a video of the undercarriage, this 1964 Mercury Cyclone. Um, the frame, ra the rear frame rails in this thing are absolutely gorgeous. Not swollen, they still have the galvanized on them. There's a wasp nest up in there. Um, even where the rear bumper brackets bolt, they aren't rusted. All the way through, just as solid as could be. Galvanized is still there. Trunk floor is not rotted out in it. This is the passenger side. Turn around, do the driver side or passenger side trunk drop off. Trunk drop offs are fine. It's got the putty on them from when they were new. The trunk drop offs are solid. The bottom of the passenger side quarter is rotten. That's a pretty easy fix relatively speaking. Driver's side torque box, pardon me, trunk drop off is flawless also. Still has the original quarter. It's as solid as could be. It's starting to get some right in here. Yeah, well, it's got rust there. Um, rear frame rails, absolutely gorgeous. Wheel wells, same. Not all rusted out. Solid surface rust. Rear torque boxes. They're as good as they look. Back of the trunk floor pan, not rusted out. The front floor boards are smoked in it. Um, it, it will need a complete front floor, floor pan. They make them new, Dana Corn makes them. That's the best way to do it in anyways. I'm not sure what we got going on here, why they added that, but somebody added it in its life. Um, this torque box is nice. Spring perches are nice. Both sides. Like I said, floorboards are smoked. Front frame rails, I'd call them immaculate. The transmission um, hump brace is not rusted out like a lot of them are. Hell, even the brake lines aren't even rusted out. Fuel lines not rusted out. Torque boxes, front torque boxes are gorgeous. Still has the, the original uh, entry hole to get to the parking brake. Fronts are not rusted out at all. 100% solid. So, like I said, we'll, we'll go back to the floorboards. They're junk. Passenger side torque box. Not rusted out how they all normally are. This car came out of Oklahoma uh, and it shows. Rocker panels are not rotted out. Very solid, still galvanized. Bench seat supports are still in it. Parking brake. Um, this was a power steering car. Frame rails up front are perfect. This one doesn't look like it was ever pulled with, well, there's one, one little spot where it was pulled pulled with a chain, which you just hammer it back up and it'd be fine. I gutted the brakes on it so it rolled easy. My phone kind of sucks. Rear front frame rails, they're not rusted out. Even up here where the, uh, the uh, below the A-arms, not, not rotted out. Very, very solid. Up front where they always hold dirt, it's not rotted out. This is a good, solid project car. Like I said, I don't like selling welfare junk. Especially rusted out junk. Battery tray solid in it. Most of them are smoked. Still got the inspection marks on it. Tires roll nice and easy. Here's the other torque box. Driver's side, this video is a little shaky. Sorry guys. Bottom side's not rotted. I told a few guys I would shoot an underside video. Here's the floorboards. There's the bottom of the seat. 
like I said, it's just, I would put a Dana corn floorboard in it. Drill out the spot welds, put you in a new one. Pinion snubbers, never been bent. It still has the uh, rear end snubbers on the outside. You know, honestly, the gas tank might be good. Still has the original rear end in it. Anyways, that's the underside.